Oh, we're loaded in already. Gosh. That's better. Thank you, Scotsman. Right. Uh, Bullyard Sunset. It's the 22nd of August 1963 and you're to drive 33073 on her final duty. You're taking over Evercreech Junction and will drive to Bath Green Park where you'll drop off the train and then start the long journey back to Eastley Sheds where the train will be withdrawn. Begin by filling the tender with water. Press T. Note, if you're using water fireman uh, if you are not using water fire and be begin shoveling coal now, you're going to need all the steam you can muster for the gradients up to vinegar. Okay, we'll start shoveling coal then. Uh, and we'll press T, we'll get some water in. There's the crane coming over. Why can I not move this? There we go. Ooh, nice. And the, the low sun just makes this more atmospheric. Right, let's get a first look on the, uh, on the footplate, shall we? I have not driven this engine at all yet. I have no idea what I'm looking at, what's what. It's quite a nice view from the window, but we'll still do head out. Can you... no, it doesn't come through the cab. Steam Master says silver. All aboard Jenkins Express, yay! Uh, how hot is what pie, James? You mean me, me pizza? It's going cold. Uh, da, 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 da. Steam master says silver. Silver. Neslam says non. Kev says silver. Right, here we go. It's all topped up. Time to take 33037 on her last duty. And I'll stop run to Bath Green Park. Do her proud. Well, that's quite high pitched. Right, the brakes are coming off. We're moving in a second. The cylinder's open. Yes, they are. No steam coming from them, though. Me going for gold. Yeah, I hope so. We shall see, though. That can go back into running. Turn the cylinders off, not that they actually did anything. Uh. <laughs> no, Kev, you cannot retract that bet. <laughs> Here, if you're on the Jenkins Express. If you want, there may be a spad or worse, like a crash. It's not comfortable either when I keep slamming the emergency brakes on. Right, we're using all of our boiler pressure, which is not a good idea. We've got a long climb ahead. fails here. James wants a thousand points. Um, you're hoping, James. Victory Works Loco. Ah, is it a Victory Works? Black Five coming through. Um, NASCAR. It was actually a, a car park at one point for Sainsbury's. 
the whole station. They, they, they kept the frontage and the roof and the rest of it was a car park. Right there we have the 70 as we begin the climb. That hand is very dis uh, discomforting. Right, I did not know that this was a Victory Works loco. Right, I don't know why I pulled back so much on that. Because that's the only way I can stop it from killing the boiler pressure. That's why. strange. We'll stop calling up for a minute. One Henry, one of Henry the Green Engine's friends. That's only after he was re rebuilt though. And he became a Black Five. Oh no, this is absolutely killing my uh, my speed and my boiler pressure is not in a good place. Well, it is, but it just keeps going down. Let's try putting the blow on, see if that helps. These are low speeds. Okay, so uh, Matt's now started streaming, everyone's gone. Fire little and often. Uh, every two minutes I think it is, Laurie, that they say. Ah, good, we're uh, gaining boiler pressure again. Which means that we can open her up a little bit. Not too much, just a little bit. I don't know what the me command is, so I can't help you on that one, I'm afraid, Steam. Stick, it does look very boxy. To be honest with you, I only got it because I wanted the uh, some of the wagons that came with it. So, uh, but we're on, we're on the increase, we're... Uh, Building up speed a little bit. Let's get a little bit more coal on. Keep it going. Okay, I have no idea uh, how you do that, um, Steam. Ah, there we go, we're at a point whereby we're uh, pulling away again. Right, stop putting coal on. Right, our waypoint is in uh, seven minutes. We're not going to do it at these low speeds. Let's try and no, that killed it. All right, I'm going to eat since there's not a lot that we can do at the moment. side so we can actually see the track.
thank you very much Steam um, thank you for coming and being involved in the chat hey a tractor uh, yeah thank you very much Steam thank you for coming and being involved uh, I do hope that you've enjoyed the stream this evening train on a bridge train on a bridge we've got to get trains on the bridge yay got it pretty in real life either. <laughs> oh dear, we need to put water in. That's not going to do our body pressure much good. Which in turn isn't going to help our speed. Five minutes to get there, and we got uh, 1.3 miles to do. And this hill doesn't seem to be easy. Okay, thank you very much for joining, Stick. Thank you for the follow, and I shall see you next week, hopefully. There's the top of the hill, so we'll save the water now until we get to the top. Let's get up at a little bit more speed. We should be fine going down the other side. That should uh, allow us to in increase the speed quite nicely. Then we can see what the loco can do. It does seem to have a slightly different tone to it. I will agree with you there, NASCAR. I don't know if that's because it was uh, based on an American model and mass produced. Right now the light's catching that. Right, there's Shepperton just come up on the hood. Let's uh, get going, get some water in that boiler some speed in them wheels. Head out. There we go. Right, let's get this going as quick as we can. Let's get the fire back in a good place. We've got another climb coming up. sorting out. Hey, 200 points. It sounds like it's saying no, I can't. <laughs> Yeah, it's nice. Oh, 
Rocking and rolling. Let's go back to head out. Right. I need to be careful now that I don't kill my own uh, speed in an attempt to get it to climb better. We've got this pesky 30 miles an hour coming up as well. Which isn't funny. But the hill should sort that out. Just ease off again, let that come down a little bit more. There we go. Speed's coming down. For the 30, there we go, we'll put that back on. There's our tunnel. So we need to blow on the firebox closed. We'll be going down through Comb Down Tunnel. Uh, yes, we will, but I don't know which one it is. Into one of the tunnels. leveled out very slightly. I think it levels out again in a little bit. Right, there's the uh, board for the 70. NASCAR, I believe it is the longer one, and I believe it's on the downhill run because it's uphill coming out of Bath, but I may be wrong. Um, I did watch a YouTube video quite recently on the route actually, which was quite interesting. Uh, they showed some of the points and that of the route, which was really fascinating to see. Ah, good, that injector shut up. Masbury just come up on the hood. 
It was the one with Ivo Peters and one of the old S and D crews. Um, it was he wasn't one of the crews. I believe he was one of the signalmen here at Masbury. Welcome back, Stick. No, I've killed my boiler pressure. Which in turn is killing my speed. say so myself. Getting that balance right to get it up this hill. I'm really hoping it levels out shortly because we are on the verge of stalling. And it's taken all the boiler pressure I've got to keep it level. Right, we've got the green. Yay, we've leveled out slightly in the station. Right, I'm not going to worry about the water till we get to the top, hopefully. Ah, it was Midford. I knew it began with an M. And it's where the double comes down to a single. Um, I'm still here, Stick. <laughs> Almost there. Fifty. There's the top of the hill. You can actually see it. Don't do a Gordon and get stuck. Almost there. Almost there. Right, we've done it. We're at the top. We've just got to drag all of this lot up. OK, we're now starting to go down the other side. Let's get some speed up. Let's get some water in. Alright, a 1 in 73 down the other side. We might get it up to 70. We've got seconds to spare to get through uh, vinegar. Over the bridge. James is still here. The scenery looks very bland. I wouldn't say that. I'm quite enjoying the scenery. No, I think that looks quite nice for this part of the world. Oh gosh, my boiler pressure's gone. And a bit to get speed up, I've killed my pressure. Let's just let it roll down the hill then. Plan going up the hill. I think that's just because we were taking a long time stick. And this is quite an old route. This is uh, one of the originals, I believe. Timeliness bonus, 200 points. 
next one is Chilcompton. NASCAR, I've just seen that message. Um, it did look as though you saw the same same film. Right, going down to 1 in 67. Nice. Just let it roll. Right, we don't need to worry about that quite so much now. Or that. This will be sorted soon as well. One of the things that I did like was the um, device that they had on the Midford signal box that would swing out with the token on and the train could pick it up as it went past so that it didn't have to stop before hitting the hill. Right, let's power down. Have I heard of the Y Valley Line? I've heard of it, but I don't know anything about it, NASCAR. Right, we'll ease off. We're vastly approaching 17. We've got a long hill down. Okay, we can start putting some brake on. Need more brake. A bit less. Tiny bit less. That'll do. Missile through Chill Compton, we're doing almost 70 miles an hour. Right, we've got a tunnel coming up which we'll need to blow on for. Check that the doors are closed. There's Midford. No. Midsummer Norton. It's a very steep hill. How can trains even make it up? Um, well, we've just climbed steeper. Let's put the blow on for the, for the tunnel. Um, we have just climbed steeper. But quite often you'll find that they were double-headed or they were uh, banked uh, on this line to get them up and down them. Uh, NASCAR, send that to me in a whisper please. I'm in the boiler again. We can turn the blower off. We're back to the kind of position that we want to be in. And we're three minutes early through Midsummer Norton, which is good. Making great time. Downhill again. Right, we have a 50 at Redstock that we need to be aware of. Just because of how steep this hill is, it might be difficult to break for that. Right, let's get a little bit more coal on. We seem to have burnt a little bit just uh, over that time. Coal does burn. Bit of 
braking. A bit more braking, let's get it down to 50 now. That'll come into effect a lot more as we hit this uh, slightly flat, flat a bit. Right, the road is all sorted in case we need to climb. There we go, we'll release that brake now. As we come down through Radstock. I'm expecting a lot of speeding and a slight chance of death. <laughs> See, you don't get that on match channel, do you, Stick? When you can drive trains, it's boring. <sighs> right, we're almost in the 70 again. So we'll uh, start opening for that when we get past the... Uh, Boards. We're going up a very slight hill. There's the 70. So let's go. Shokum and single hill hook to halt two. We're not stopping. Uh, let's get that up to there and bring it back. There, there we go. Use the engine uh, most effectively. Crashing is part of the fun, indeed. Crashing is part of the fun. And even if you don't crash, the expectedness of a crash, if ever expectedness was a word. Right, head out. Right, we're back up to 60. Go via Shoska and Single Halt, that's this one here that we're about to fly through at 65 mile an hour. May even get it back up to 70 by that point. Don't worry, we've got more hills before we get to Bath. Oh, we have got it up to 70. Drive quality minus 41. Why? I'm in the speed limit. Well, there goes your thousand points, James. I was working really hard to get that. But I don't think that was my fault. Right, next one's Wello, platform two. Got, oh, look at that for scenery. That in itself just deserves that. Oh, I missed a bit with the river in it. Never mind. Right, increase the speed again. It is a word in the Jenks dictionary. The Jenks English and a bit dictionary. 99.99 in all good bookstores. <laughs> Oh good, we've got pressure again, let's get some more coal on, just to keep that up, and keep the boiler up as well, I'm not quite sure where the next hill is, so just looking after these, even though we'll be wasting pressure. That way I know that I've got it when I need it, and I'll be making it effectively. Okay, we've got another downhill wind going. Here's well out. Another timeliness bonus. 
go via Midford Platform 1. Have I ever read a poem called The Night Mail? Uh, by W.H. Alban, I believe. Or is it Auden? W.H. Auden. Yes, I have. Right, we've got a 30 at Midford, unfortunately, so we'll start breaking for that now. Um, NASCAR, I can recite quite a bit of it, actually. Don't know if I will, but I can. I just can't get the bit in the middle and the bit at the end. Yeah, it's W.H. Jordan. Slowed for the 30, possibly a little bit too early, so we're just gonna come off the brake and let it roll down the hill. This may have set us up badly for our next waypoint. NASCAR, thinking of Nightmail, did you see the film with the same name that it was written for? Right, here's the 30 coming into Midford. We'll uh, let the signalman know that we're here so that we can have our token for single line running. Train on a bridge, train on a bridge. Train speeding in Midford. No, not that one, that one. Bring that speed down. And I'm missing train on a bridge. No, let's get that, there we go. There we go. We have the token. As you approach Brass Green, slow down, ready for the 15 mile an hour yard speed limit, uh, stop at Bath, down shunting line, ready to reverse the train. That was an awesome film. And uh, very applicable with the, um, with the Saint being out as well. Because it's all about the travelling post office. Let's get this uh, fire up. We seem to have neglected it again. No, still speeding. Look, I need the speed to get up this hill. Trust me, they ran at 70 through here. I've seen the footage. Have I finished my pizza? Yeah, it's, it's finished. Well, the bit that I'm eating today is... climb this hill. Then we've got Coombe Tunnel. I believe this is Coombe coming up. We are killing the boiler pressure. It's either boiler pressure or speed, pick one. Because you can't have both. Right, that on, that closed. That's it, that's the fire that we've got all the way through this tunnel now. Gaining both. We can use a bit of that boiler pressure then. WH Jordan it was. Who wants me to recite the first couple of verses?
It is a big tunnel. Quite nasty as well, because by the time you get to about this point, the engine's working and snorting away, and you're just getting all the smut delivered back into the cab. Um, it's even worse coming up this one. Jeff Gordon finished good. a bit of break now as we come down this bank. We need to stop there. Little full brakes, we don't quite want full brakes. Ah, you want me to say the first few lines of the poem? Who else? Quite quick, yes or no? If you want me to recite the first few lines of the poem, say yes. quality minus say but I can't help it, I'm on the brake. I was told to brake hard. Well, he finished sixth in his last race. Like the West in chat. Um, okay. So it begins this is the nightmare crossing the border. Bring in the check and the postal order. Letters for the rich, letters for the poor. The shop at the corner, the girl next door. Pulling up bait of the steady climb. The gradient's against the but she's on fire. Past cotton grass and moorland boulders, shoveling white steam over her shoulder, snorting noisily as she passes silent miles of the windbank grasses. Sheepdogs cannot turn her course, they slumber on with paws across. In a farm she passes, no one wakes but a jug in the bedroom. A jug in the bedroom gently shakes. And then it goes, dawn freshens. Her climb is done. Down towards Glasgow she descends, and that's the bit I can't remember. Um, NASCAR, can you put in the bit from there up until the letters bit, the good bit? Um, down towards Glasgow she descends towards the something, uh, I've forgotten it. Dick says he's, uh, he's heard of it. Yeah, it's quite a famous poem. When the engine shuts up, I'll, uh, I'll finish it. Right, now I don't know how far forward we need to go. 
what are our instructions? Drop off wagons and brake plan at siding 1. So we'll be reversing into there. So we need to clear that, which we have. There we go. <laughs> what I'll do is just before we end, I'll bring it up and I'll read it. Because then I won't have all this noise going off as well. Right, let's set this up. We go to there. Where are we going? Siding 1. So, uh, yeah, that's now set up. Why have you not come up? I've stopped. Go backwards and stop with the engine on it, shall we? Oh, we're fighting the brakes, that's why. Good stream so far, thanks, James. Still not brought me up as having stopped in. Hmm, strange. Okay, let's go and do the next task. No, because that's going to give me a fail. I don't know how to make that recognise that I've stopped. Sorry guys, anybody who said gold, it's probably gone. I've got to uh, back up. Oh, hold on, what's that? There's a stop sign there, what does that do? Nothing. The engine makes a lot of noise when it's venting the safety valves. Try stopping when it says 0 miles. Yeah, I've tried that. Doesn't work. Okay, so I'm going to see what this deducts, and then I'm going to add that back on, because I don't think that was fair. Right, we'll uncouple them. Is it everything that's coming off? Yep. 500, so we're adding 500 back on to whatever our final score is. We've got to stop there again. Um, NASCAR, I'll, I'll read it, um, I'll bring it up in a second and I'll read it before I end the stream. Alright, we'll try 
much stuff in there. There we go. So now I've got to work out what I've done. Drive forwards via Bathgate. Stop just after the points to Bathgate 4 and change them so you can reverse via Bathgates 4 and 7. Do not pass the signal into siding 16 and 17. Okay. What earth is he talking about? So via that and to there. Not go into there. Well, that's fine because what we can do is we can do that. Right, let's carry on. Yeah, it's all gone now. You've got a giant car park that's in the station building over here somewhere. It's all gone. Where's the signal that we must not pass? I'm going to say we must not pass that one as well. Have we passed the end? Yes, we have. Lovely. So that should now have changed. Let's just go over and check. That view, that view. No, I've got to do that one. There we go. Backwards we go. Right, let's just check that we're going the right way. There's four, there's seven. And that's it. We end up on that lane there. Hey Kev, welcome back. Uh, yeah, last time I knew it was a Sainsbury's, but it might have changed since then. The end. Ah, oh, okay. Bullied Q... Q133073 was withdrawn on 24th of August 1963. She was scrapped two months later along with 39 of the 40 members of the class. C133001 was preserved for the National Collection and ran on the preserved Blue Bell Railway until 2004. As of 2014, she can be seen on static display at the National Railway Museum in York. Aww. Well, at least one, one survived. There we go. All finished. Right, so just before we go, I didn't see, oh, I didn't see the score. Let me come back. Right, 317. Add in the 500 that I said I would add back on. That makes 817. That's silver. So well done to everyone who says silver. I've pressed the wrong button.